I'm Tia's mum, Mime. <laughs> Mime Rando. Okay, I'm here with Tia. She is in an idol group here in Japan called PIDL in the sexy team. Yeah. Team L. Team L. The oh, sexy this team. Way. <laughs> yeah. That's where all the sexy members go. <laughs> And um, I just think like being an idol, it's a pretty interesting career choice. So can you answer some questions today? Yeah, sure. Awesome. Hi everyone, I'm PIDL's Team L, L Tia, or in English, Tia L. <laughs> Wait, I never realized how that edit is like Team Edit. Yeah. It's like L, 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 L. Like PIDL no Team Edit no Edit Tia, like that. Edit, edit, edit. Originally you came here to be a model, not an mm. idol, right? Yeah. So how did you end up going from being a model to an idol? I guess I did modeling for about five or six months, I guess. And then I just kind of got more interested in like the TV and like entertainment world and um. more like of the like speaking and performing kind of. Mm. So I decided to make the switch to an idol, I guess. Yeah, my agency hooked me up with like a audition and Oh. Yeah. So your modeling agency helped you to get into it in a mm -hmm. way. Oh. Yeah, they actually suggested it to me. Oh, really? Yeah. They were like <laughs> go be an idol and you were yeah. like, okay. <laughs> like, they actually asked me I went to the agency one day and they were like what do you think about idol groups? And I was mm. like, I don't know, they're cute. And they're like, what do you think about becoming an idol? And I was like, I don't know, I've never really thought about it before. Mm. <laughs> like, okay, let's just try this interview and see how it goes. And then I passed. So could you get by as a model without much Japanese? As a model, you can, mm. I guess. For an idol, you need to speak Japanese. Okay guys, so yeah. if you want to be an idol, time to start studying. How long have you been studying Japanese? I've been studying about nine years now, oh I my guess, gosh. since I was 11 years old. That's amazing! Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. But my Japanese is still really not that good. That's not true. But <laughs> <laughs> so how did you get into modeling? When I was in Canada, my agency actually emailed me from my blog, oh. like from my Japanese blog, my Amebudo. And they were like very interested in signing me and asking, do you have any plans to come to Japan? And I said, yeah, actually, I'm going, on, um, I'm going there on a working holiday visa. So when I went to Tokyo, I met up with them, and yeah, I signed with them. And so they approached yeah. you based on like photos mm -hmm. you had online. Yeah, exactly. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> had you done modeling in Canada? No. Not at all. So it was just based, that's so crazy. Mm -hmm. So right now you're in PIDL, which is quite a big group mm -hmm. with lots of girls. What is that like? Um, well, you know how girls can be. Like I'm a girl, <laughs> so I know how we can be. Yeah. <laughs> Good things are like, you know, being around a lot of girls and especially like we're all, our career is like, you know, based on our looks mm. and like stuff like that. So we are always giving each other's tip, mm. each other tips and, um, like, you know, that doesn't look good on you, maybe you should try something like this, like this clothing or this makeup better or like, but they'll also like come up to you and be like, Tia, your face is so, like, what happened to your face today? <laughs> <laughs> I imagine that working in the entertainment industry, especially in Japan where we do tend to put in like pretty long hours, mm -hmm. no matter what the job is, is quite stressful. Yeah. How often do you sleep? <laughs> That on a when we're releasing a new single, it might be maybe four to five hours oh or something like that because you know we're practicing and in the studio we're in the studio about 12 hours. At 12 a hours just in the studio yeah, practicing, for, yeah, for a new single. Oh my gosh, but there must be a little bit of downtime too, like it's not always crazy. Well, of course, like after you know the heat of like a new single coming out kind of cools down and we had a little time off and yeah maybe like a, a day off in a month <laughs> <Day or so. laughs> so if we get a day off in a month it's like yes we have a day off like and then you're like what should I do sleep. yeah then I should stay <laughs> home all day. even though it can be tough at times what kind of inspires you and motivates you this is really what I want to do like mm. you know I've been dreaming about I've always wanted to do something in the entertainment industry mm. in Japan and um, I guess really positive messages from fans and stuff mm, really yeah. really keep me going like I'll be having like a really bad day like maybe I couldn't remember some like choreography and 
was getting kind of down about it. And then on Twitter, like, yeah. I'll get a really nice message and I'm like, it's like being a YouTuber, yeah. except not. It's completely different. But when I see those yeah. kind messages, they like mm -hmm. make my day. Yeah, and the other day, like, someone came to our cafe and he said, like, I was having a really bad day, so I came here just to see your face. And I was like, aww. aww <laughs> I was so happy, really. Yeah. <laughs> he was so happy. Man, I, I can, feel you. Yeah. <laughs> it's like when I, when I do free hugs and I'm mm -hmm. like, it's it's almost selfish mm -hmm. because I get so much joy and love mm -hmm. from hugging people. <laughs> so it's like I'm just yeah. taking all these hugs, <laughs> but I'm giving them too. Yeah. So it's I'm like I'm sure the people getting the hugs are happy too. I hope so. They wouldn't come up to you for it. That's true. <laughs> they would probably run away. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and one last question. Mm -hmm. Um, you mentioned that like you really wanted to be in Japan doing this. Why yeah. did you decide on Japan? Was it like you saw Momosu and you were like yes? <laughs> well, no. no. <laughs> I don't know, I just love Japan. And then I, I came here on my working holiday, and then I just really liked it here. Because and... that's a test, know. right? Like, you have yeah. to come here and really experience it mm -hmm. to know whether you love it enough to stay here. Because yeah. there's good points and bad points. Mm -hmm. And that's, it's like. That's so true. Right, it's whether you can deal with the good yeah. and the bad. Mm -hmm. Like any country in the world. Mm -hmm. There's really like. I don't know, there's some people who want to live here, but it's just, it's just impossible. Right. Like, it's really hard. Mm. Yeah. It's hard, but I, I love it. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so I hope that helped anyone who's interested in entering the entertainment industry here. And good luck if you are! Check out Tia's links, I'll put them all down below. And if you enjoyed this video and it was helpful for you, please give it a thumbs up. It helps me out a lot. See you!